This is Susan Hudson, VP at Equa Marketing. And this is Jamie Edson, Marketing Communications Specialist. And today we're talking about online reputation management. Information today is a digital commodity. Your practice website and blog, your social media profiles, and review sites are hot with information. People don't want doctored advertisements anymore. They want the real stuff. They want to know what your business or practice is all about and who you are, and more importantly, what you can offer them. The internet has simply changed everything. Absolutely, Jamie. Why bother with the yellow pages when with a few clicks of your keyboard or smartphone, you can access absolutely any kind of information about a business, person, or thing. Whether you're looking for information on a political figure, a big corporation, government agency, commerce, or entertainment, it's all online. The internet literally can make or break just about anything. It definitely can, Susan, and it is precisely for this reason why online reputation is so huge. Really, it doesn't matter who you are. If you have a digital footprint, guarding or managing it is an absolute necessity. Indeed it is, Jamie. And the way information spreads over the internet, your blogs, social media, and tweets can just as easily damage your online reputation as a negative story by a major news publication. This is the power of the internet. Information is far reaching and can spread rapidly. Coming to that, Susan, we have seen the rapid growth of review sites and their growing role in shaping the reputation of a business or practice. However, online reputation management is a lot bigger than just a snazzy website or blog, right? Oh yeah, if we are talking about online reputation management, it is vital that you control, monitor, and influence what is being said about your business or practice. You can't really afford to have any loose cannons. So true, Susan. So what can businesses and practices do to secure their online reputation? Well, Jamie, when it comes to reputation management or just about anything related to online marketing, you simply cannot follow a one-glove-fits-all approach. There are, however, general guidelines that can work effectively in managing your online reputation. So next, I'm going to talk about four of the more important rules. Number one, instead of limiting yourself to a handful of links featured at the top of search engine result pages, what you need to do is to focus on taking advantage of all your search engine result page rankings. Control it from top to bottom, making sure that you rank for the terms real people are searching for, and then deliver the information they seek when they click on your page. Next, social media can do wonders for your brand's online reputation. However, most businesses and practices still fall short in making full use of it. The long and the short of it, Jamie, is simply that you need to own your social space. Granted, some social sites offer more benefits than others. However, it's always best to claim your brand name on all the leading social networks. Look at the bigger picture improved online presence and greater control of your search results. Item number three, you can't only depend on practice brand news when it comes to press releases. Try and identify unique ways in which your practice can deliver greater client benefits and talk about it. If you sponsor events, no sense in keeping that quiet. Spread the word. Again, if you're working with affiliate partners, talk about them. Think big and think fun. Develop marketing campaigns featuring contests and offer a prize. Remember, social media is a lie, and because of this, you have to keep moving and provide new ideas. Finally, true client engagement requires some form of visual aid. YouTube videos, fun infographics, slide share presentations are all fantastic ways to reach out to your target audience. Visual content can quickly go viral and dominate a Google search. So yes, your SERPs get a boost, your online presence grows, and your brand reputation takes a giant leap forward. But remember, everything has its day. 
staying relevant on the internet is an ongoing process, not a one-hit wonder kind of deal. So in essence, it really bottles down to management, doesn't it? I mean, the internet is just huge, and if businesses and practices want to dominate their online space, they need to start managing their online presence and seek ways in which they can positively grow their digital footprint. Thank you so much for talking to us today, Susan, and thank you for sharing your insight on online reputation. My pleasure, Jamie. And if anyone has any questions about this topic or any other marketing topic, please email us and we'll get back to you as quickly as possible.